When it comes to financial advice, you got to trust the source. It's why you listen to this podcast. When I'm looking to upgrade my wallet, I turn to NerdWallet. Their expert team of nerds dives into the details to help you find smarter financial products. Before NerdWallet, I was paying for vacations all wrong. (laughs) I was missing out on miles. I didn't even know I was leaving on the table. Now I've got a new card with more miles and more upgrades. What could future you do with more travel rewards? I don't know, maybe that fancy hotel upgrade that you have always been dreaming about. Wherever you go next, make it happen with a smarter travel credit card. Don't wait to make smart financial decisions. Compare and find smarter credit cards, savings accounts, and more today at nerdwallet.com. NerdWallet finance smarter. As with all cards, credit is subject to lender approval and terms apply. There is nothing I love more than an amazing meal with high quality meat cooked at home because let's be honest, eating out is so expensive. And you also know that eating out is the number one budget buster. That is why I am so glad I found ButcherBox. ButcherBox is a premium meat subscription service dedicated to delivering high quality, grass-fed and grass-finished beef, organic chicken, pork raised crate free, and wild caught seafood directly to your doorstep with free shipping always. You even get exclusive member deals, recipes, and a variety of high quality cuts at an amazing price. New users will receive their choice of two pounds of ground beef, three pounds of chicken thighs, or one pound of premium steak tips for a year. Use code ETM and get $20 off your first box at ButcherBox.com. Last night, we made a beef stew with meat from ButcherBox, and you can taste the difference. It was so satisfying and delicious, and all of our friends that were over for a dinner party, they raved at how good it was. So do yourself a favor and eat better this year with the best meat and seafood on the planet delivered to your door. ButcherBox is offering my listeners their choice of a weeknight meal essential, three pounds of chicken thighs, two pounds of ground beef, or one pound of premium steak tips for free in every order for a year. Plus, get $20 off your first order. Sign up today at butcherbox.com slash etm and use code ETM to choose your free offer and get $20 off. Hey, I'm Shauna Compton Game. This is Millennial Money, and today we're talking Grab This App Auto Gravity. So I'm going to start featuring some of the money apps that I love that are on my iPhone as we speak. And again, this is not a paid promotion of this particular company or app, but it's just, I think, a cool apps that you guys should have that are really helping make life easier. And today we're talking to Auto Gravity. I know I mentioned them on a podcast um, maybe a month ago. But I had the chance to interview Serge from Autogravity and talk all about, you know, the future of buying cars on your phone, what Autogravity is up to, and how they are making the process of buying a car so much easier. Because with Autogravity, you can use the app to find the car that you like, find the dealership in your area, and get four financing options for your car before you even step foot into the dealership. And I love that idea because I don't know about you, but there's something about like wasting a whole entire day in the dealership where you're looking at cars and then you find the car you want and then you go and meet with the financing person and then it's a back and forth and back and forth. And it's always a time where your blood pressure goes up and maybe you start sweating or you break out into a full on panic. It's just not an enjoyable experience. I think I've bought two cars in my entire life that were enjoyable experiences. So I think this is really awesome that technology is helping us, you know, reshape these processes, especially to do with money where we're we're out purchasing things and it is stressful and turning it into an enjoyable experience where we can take care of the financing part, the hard part, the part that nobody likes to deal with from the convenience of our own home, sitting on our couch, 
um, lounging out by the pool, whatever you want to do, you know, so that when you actually walk into the dealership, you know, you're going to get a loan, right? It's just a matter of going and actually physically touching and looking and sitting inside and smelling or whatever your process is, the car that you actually want, and then signing the paperwork and you're out the door. So check out this interview with Auto Gravity, and I definitely think if you're in the the hunt for a new car, a used car, that this is definitely something you should check out and just to see what kind of options it gives you in terms of financing. All right, Serge, I'm so excited to have you on the podcast today talking all about auto gravity and the future of car buying. Thank you. It is a pleasure to join you. Very cool. So I've had a podcast on where I talked a little bit about auto gravity, but you know, it's always great to hear the information from uh, from the source. So there are so many apps out there, you know, directed mm-hmm. at millennials to make life easier. I mean, you name it, right? There's a million different apps a day. But mm-hmm. tell us about Auto Gravity and why it deserves a download. Well, Auto Gravity exists to make car shopping and car financing easier and more convenient and to put people in control through that shopping and financing journey. Um, it's tens of millions of cars change hands every single year. I think 17 million cars new cars were purchased last year, and almost mm. all of them are financed. Right. It's not that, that people, whether millennials or otherwise, people don't go to the car dealership with a bag full of money and drop it on the dealership's desk and say, you know, here's $35,000 in ones. Give me my BMW. It, it's when, when folks buy cars, typically you have a monthly payment. You have a budget in mind for that car. So you, you know that you're going to have to pay for insurance, for gas, and the monthly car payment. And it has to fit in whether it's 150 a month or 300 a month or 500 a month or, or whatever it is. All of that car expense has to fit in whatever your budget can afford or you're going to find yourself in a financial situation that you're not going to like. Right, exactly. And, mm-hmm. you know, we, we all think of, you know, going to buy a car as kind of like the, the finance part is like the part we dread, right? We start like breaking out in a sweat, um, <laughs> you know, thinking about negotiations and all those sorts of things. So, I mean, what I love about this is it, it really, it takes that stress away from you, right? Yeah, it can be. It, it, I, I wouldn't say it's it's stress. It's intimidation. Uh, sure. Financing can be really intimidating because there's so much that people feel like they have to know before they go into the process. Um, and it's unless you were paying attention in in undergrad in, in economics or, or in business, it's like you know you don't deal with down payments and interest rates. Certainly not money factors. In, in your day-to-day life. And you have to build up this like specialized degree in finance before you go to buy a car. It's kind of kind of silly. So we, we, we basically built the platform to make it digestible and understandable for people and give you confidence into what that monthly payment's going to be before you go to the dealership, but, but also give you a choice. Sure. The, the way that the car shopping journey exists for most people today is you, you, you spend, gosh, a dozen hours online looking at different cars, making sure that you get a good price on the vehicle you want to buy. You go to the dealership, you can spend four or five hours there on a Saturday, test driving a few cars, falling in love with a car. And it's only at the very end of that journey that you go to the back office and the dealer pulls your credit, sees offers, selects an offer for you and says, you know, here you go. This is going to fit into your budget. And as a user, you, you don't know that way. And again, this is, this is true for millennials. It's true for everybody. You, you don't know if that's a fair deal because you didn't really get to see your options. And you didn't really know what that deal was going to look like until you're right there in that very last minute. And there's a lot of pressure. So, you know, somebody worked to pull this deal together for you and you feel almost obligated to just take it. Right. Financial anxiety, anyone? Yeah, you're not alone. But worrying about it, it doesn't help. Earnin does. Earnin is an app that gives you access to your pay as you work up to $100 per day or up to $750 per pay period. You just download the Earnin app and verify your paycheck. Then you can access up to $100 per day as you work and leave an additional tip. Any money you access plus tips are automatically repaid from your next paycheck. So how would you spend the money you get from Earnin? Well, Honestly, my hubby and I have been feeling a little bit disconnected lately. That's what happens after you've been together about 12 years. So I would spend the money on a special date night with dinner and maybe bowling, you know, to bring back some of that giggly excitement that we both felt at the beginning. Make Earnin a part of your financial routine and join Earnin's over three and a half million customers who say things like, when I think about Earnin, 
I think about financial stability, security, gives me a lot of peace of mind. Download Earnin today, spelled E-A-R-N-I-N, in the Google Play or Apple App Store. When you download the Earnin app, type in Talkin, T-A-L-K-A-N, money under podcast when you sign up. It will really help the show. Talkin money under podcast. Subject to your available earnings, location, daily max, and pay period max. See earnin.com slash TOS for details. Earnin is a financial technology company, not a bank. Bank products are issued by Evolve Bank & Trust, member FDIC. Listen, if you've been using Mint to manage your money, I have got some news for you. First, the bad news. As you might know, Mint is shutting down for good. But the good news? Well, there is a way better alternative that is a personal favorite of mine, Monarch Money. And I'm not the only lover of Monarch Money. Many Mint users are turning to Monarch Money and just raving about it. I used to manage my money with an Excel spreadsheet. I know, so archaic. And it was so time consuming. I tried all of the apps, but I just didn't find one I liked until I found Monarch. And I've got to tell you a secret. Monarch is so easy to use with a very intuitive design. You can even collaborate with your partner and you can customize Monarch for whatever your needs are. Monarch is the top rated all-in-one personal finance app. It gives you a comprehensive view of all your accounts, investments, transactions, and more. Create custom budgets, set goals, and collaborate with your partner. And now get an extended 30-day free trial when you go to monarchmoney.com etm. Let's go back to the collaboration bit. Because we know money is a leading cause of divorce and breakups, Monarch has built in collaboration features so you can invite your partner at no extra cost. You can see all your finances, make a budget together, get insights on your cash. Yes, cue the confetti. There will literally not be any more arguments over money. And if you've been frustrated with personal finance apps that are cluttered with ads, difficult to use, or rarely updated, so was Monarch. They built a new kind of personal finance app that's intuitive and powerful ad-free, and constantly improving based on customer feedback. Monarch has a tool that allows you as well to easily import your data from Mint. You can keep all of your tags and all of your categories. After trying Monarch for myself, I understand why it's the top-rated personal finance app. And right now, get an extended 30-day free trial when you go to monarchmoney.com slash etm. That's M-O-N-A-R-C-H-M-O-N-E-Y dot com slash etm for your extended 30-day free trial. With, with, with auto gravity, you're able to see not just one deal, but up to four different offers from four different lenders before you go to the dealership. So you can use it at home with your family, on your couch. You can try using it at work, um, wh wherever you have you. And, and it takes less than 10 minutes to pick a car, pick a dealership, search for financing, and see those offers. And, and it gives you two things. One, you can see the offers in the comfort of your home. So you're able to see what the amount approved is. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. The, the bank's giving me $25,000 to play with. You can see what your rate's going to be, and you can really understand whether that's a good rate or whether you could do a little bit better. And you get a sense of what your monthly payment is going to be in a no-pressure environment because it is just you and, and your family or whoever right. it is that you've pulled in. And then when you go to the dealership, you're empowered. Like uh, Oftentimes, if you, if you go to the dealership, you don't even know if you're going to get approved. It's really embarrassing. It can be humiliating if you go and you spend all this time buying the car, and then at the very end, the dealer tells you, I'm, I'm sorry, I can't help you. Right, or, exactly. I'm, I'm sorry. You, you want to just crawl under yeah. the table. <laughs> yeah, or, or either that or like, you know, like here's your 20, 25% interest rate. <laughs> right, <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Tough, right? Yeah, yeah. And, and one of the things that we've heard from our users is if you apply on auto gravity and, and you're building your credit and you don't have a very strong credit profile, you will see high interest rates from the banks, mm -hmm. but you see them in the comfort of your own home. And, and we've had users tell us, you know, thank you for, for letting me see these rates and letting me see these deals before I went to the dealership. What I'm going to do is I'm going to spend the next few months cleaning up my credit, building up my credit so that when I go to the dealership, I can go with stronger rates. And, and that's something that people didn't really have access to before, the, the ability to be able to look your financial self in the mirror and see what it what that's going to look like anytime, anywhere you want. And even that can be powerful if you don't end up buying the car that week or the next week. Yeah, because it gives you, like you say, it gives you the opportunity to make some sort of change or to have a real perspective of where you're at without, you know, having somebody else staring at your, at your numbers. That's right. That's right. So, so the process, you know, someone downloads the app, they can shop for the car and they can mm -hmm. apply for financing. And let's say they get, you know, however many four, you know, approvals, how do they then, because this is always the question I get, is how do they know then when they go to the dealership, you know, mm -hmm. I, how does that process then work? 
Yeah, it's a good question. We work with – Autogravity works with many of the same lenders that the dealership works with. Um, even though that there are thousands of car lenders out there, there's actually only about 20 lenders that do maybe nine out of every 10 deals booked at a car dealership. It's it's the, the lenders that work with the car company. So think like Toyota Financial, Honda Financial, Mercedes Financial. Sure. And it's it's big retail banks. It's the same large banks that we have our checking and credit accounts with. And Autogravity works specifically with those lenders. When you go to the dealership, we, we actually give you next steps in the app. You can go to the dealership and say, you know, I've been approved by this bank and here's my application number. The dealer can then pull up that approval and that application in their own system. And without you having to apply for credit again, they can close out that deal at the price that you and the dealership agree with. Awesome. Um, All right. Yeah, the process there is actually pretty straightforward. And, and part of it is that because you're working with the same banks and the same systems as the dealer, there's no additional steps. Right, right, exactly. So what if you, you go through this process and you get your offers back um, and maybe you don't like the four offers that you got? Mm-hmm. Is there a period of time that you should wait before you try and reapply through the app? Yeah, I mean, it, it depends on 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 what you don't like about your offers. Okay. Um, if you if you end up getting offers that you feel are relatively high, um, certainly you should check your credit history um, through perhaps annualcreditreport.com or one of the many apps out there to find out what exactly is going on. It could be that maybe something's happening to your credit that you don't know about. Maybe there's been some kind of fraud on your credit, and this is actually a good signal. Like, hey, like I should check into my credit and see what's going on. Um, but if you're building credit, it, it is a good idea to wait at least a month, um, okay. maybe several months. And it's not just waiting. It's not about like, you know, if I just wait three months, it'll get better. It's about taking action to improve your, your, your credit worthiness as measured by, by, the, by the credit bureaus, which means a number of things depending on what your credit situation is. Sure. Yeah, absolutely. That's good to know, though, because I think a lot of times people are just sort of unsure and maybe they they won't proceed at all. Um, after they get, you know, declined or they don't like the offers they have. So I, I, I love that there's kind of a guideline, a roadmap for people. So they're not just kind of out there wondering, should I do it? Should I not do it? Yeah. And, and there, there's a benefit to getting up to four connections to four different lenders. If you were to go to just your credit union and apply for financing, maybe you end up getting declined for financing or you may end up getting a high rate, but it might be that particular lender. Mm, because auto gravity point. works with a portfolio of lenders, we're able to connect you to multiple lenders. And if you now get back four declines or four very high interest rates, then you know that hey, there's a pattern. Lenders are consistently giving me this kind of response. I should do something about it. Right. Exactly. Now, I think this is this is awesome because this is definitely you know a new way to buy a car, a new way to go through this process. Where do you think this technology is taking us? Yeah, it, it, car shopping is going more and more online than it, than it used to be. Um, but what we found is that everybody, regardless of age, has their own preference in terms of how much of the process they want to be digital. Mm-hmm. Um, buying a car or leasing a car is, is a really big deal for a lot of people. For many people, it's, if not the most expensive thing that you pay for, one of the most expensive things that you pay for and own or pay for and borrow. If you think about it, it's home mortgage, um, student loans, auto loans. And then if you end up having like, you know, a big marriage or having children, those are also big expenses in your life. But it, it's not a trivial expense. And it, it, there, are, there are a lot of folks who, who say to themselves, you know, like, I, I do want this process to be digital. But at the end of the day, I still want to go to the dealership and, you know, smell the car and right. sit inside of it <laughs> before I commit to this, you know, $25,000 thing that I'm going to have in my life. Like, I, I don't want to, you know, just apply on a website, like on like apply on, on Amazon, then just have it show up and maybe what if I don't like it? You know, it's kind of inconvenient. I, I, so I, I do think that more and more people will have the option of completing the car shopping journey online, but that many folks will choose to go through some of that journey digitally and then complete the journey in the real world. Yeah, I like um, that. It's a real fusion, right? So you can kind of have that human touch. But um, like you say, you're dealing with the numbers kind of behind the scenes in the comfort of your own home. Exactly. Millions of people have lost weight with personalized plans from Noom. Like Evan, who can't stand salads and still lost 50 pounds. Salads generally for most people are the easy button, right? Right. For me, that wasn't an option. I never really was a salad guy. That's just not who I am. But Noom worked for me. 
Get your personalized plan today at Noom.com. Real Noom user compensated to provide their story. In four weeks, the typical Noom user can expect to lose one to two pounds per week. Individual results may vary. Millions of people have lost weight with personalized plans from Noom. Like Evan, who can't stand salads and still lost 50 pounds. Salads generally for most people are the easy button, Right. For me, that wasn't an option. I never really was a salad guy. That's just not who I am. But Noom worked for me. Get your personalized plan today at Noom.com. Real Noom user compensated to provide their story. In four weeks, the typical Noom user can expect to lose one to two pounds per week. Individual results may vary. Yeah, very cool. So how many different iterations? Were there a bunch of different iterations of this this app before it actually hit the market? So we, we piloted in the summer of, of last year. We, we started with iOS and just in California with one lender. Um, launched, I think iOS was in June, Android was in July, and then web was maybe around August. Um, then started gradually adding lenders. Um, we started with new car loans. Then we added new car leasing. Then we added used car loans. Then we added the trade-in valuation. Oh, okay. So inside AutoGravity, if you want to trade in a car, Let's say you have a car that's a used car getting kind of old and you want to see your trade-in value on that car when you go to get a new car. Um, you're able to value that trade-in in auto gravity so you have an expectation of what the range is going to be before you go to the dealership. But, but we, we, we basically release a new version of auto gravity every two weeks and continue to add new features to make the car shopping journey easier and to empower users through that journey. Awesome. Uh, since, we, um, since we launched, we've had... Over 400,000 people download the app. Wow. Um, Auto Gravity is actually one of the top five automotive apps in the Google Play Store. If you go to the Play Store and you go to the auto category, you'll see us as one of the top five. And we're one of the top 50 finance apps in the Apple App Store. Wow. That definitely is, says something um, about the innovation that you guys are up to. That, that's so cool. So where do you think the, where do you think the future is going with Auto Gravity? Yeah, I mean, we, we, we see ourselves continuing to grow into the car shopping market. Um, we have thousands of people applying for cars every single month, but we think that could, number could be tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands or millions. Definitely a lot of untapped potential. And, and honestly, what, what we believe is that if auto gravity provides people with a fantastic experience, they'll tell each other about it. Because there is something inherently social about buying a car. Usually before you go to buy a car, you ask your parents or your friends if they know of a good dealership or if they can go with you because you don't want to go by yourself. And we've actually found that to be true. What we've found when – because we, we do call our users and ask them, hey, what did you think of Auto Gravity? What did you like? What could we do better? We increasingly hear from users, yeah, I heard about Auto Gravity because my friend told me about it and said, hey, you should check this out. That's really cool. I love that. You know, I think it is, it's one of the only purchases with money that we do actually share with people. There's a lot of purchases that we don't, we don't let people know what we bought or how much we paid or the loan we got or anything like that. But I think, you know, with buying cars, because it can be stressful, you're right. That's, that's a very powerful uh technique that people are using to kind of share around. And I, and I think just like you said, the, the ease of using an app to buy a car, um, I think it's just, you know, kind of this cool new fusion with technology that is allowing people um, options that maybe they haven't had before. You know, I was going to say the, the other thing about technology that's interesting is, is you can take something that's quite complex and make it simple and accessible for people. Um, buying a car doesn't intuitively feel complex, but, but if you think about it, there, there's millions of cars for sale on any given day at dealerships across the country. And there's tens of thousands of dealerships that sell cars. And there are thousands of lenders out there that can finance a car, even though it's really only a few lenders that really focus in, in the marketplace. With, with Auto Gravity, one of the things that we're trying to do is we're trying to take that multitude of options mm. and simplify it down to the cars, the dealers, and the lenders that make sense for you as a, as a car shopper. Um, one example of that is when you select the car, you select the car by brand. So you might say, okay, I want a Mercedes-Benz C-Class, or I want a Toyota Corolla or Prius. When you then go to the dealership map to find dealers that are nearby, we show you dealers only in the brand that you select. And so let's say you are in the market for a Prius. You're able to, within a few taps, be able to see, okay, within 10 miles of me, there's 10 Prius dealerships. Here's all of their phone numbers. Here's all their email addresses. And I can just start calling them up. That, that process right. is actually, like, like to, to do that otherwise, would, would you can do it. Like you can look up all the dealerships nearby, but it is a bit of a pain. We, we've tried to simplify that. 
And, and similarly, when you apply for financing, we have more than four lenders. Auto Gravity works with quite a few lenders. Sure. But when you apply for financing, based off of the car that you chose, the dealer you chose, where you are in the country, we choose lenders for you with machine learning. We've actually built algorithms that try to match you to lenders that are a good fit for your credit profile and for the vehicle you're trying to finance. So we're not wasting your time and we're not wasting the lender's time. We're able to make a smart connection there. Yeah, that's awesome. I love it. So um, tell everybody how they can get Autogravity app. Yeah, so if you search in the App Store or on the Play Store for Auto Gravity, um, Auto is in car and gravity, like the, the force that pulls people down to earth. It's one word. And it's the first app that comes up in either the App Store or the Play Store. Alternatively, you can go to autogravity.com. Um, if you don't want to download the app, you can use the entire Auto Gravity process end to end from car shopping to dealer selection to searching for financing on our website. Um, and you can transition from the website to the app if you want. So if you want to pick a car and a dealership on our website and then download the app and continue your journey from there, you're able to do that. Or you can complete the entire thing on the website. Awesome. Well, this has been fantastic. I just, I love this. Um, I'm going to be shopping for a new car in, in probably a year. So I'm actually really excited to, uh, to test out this app. So thank you so much for sharing. And uh, I just think, you know, you guys are up to some really awesome things. Thank you. That, that means a lot to us. Um, it, it's exciting for us, frankly, to be part of the, the tech and innovation scene here in Southern California. Um, we've got 75 people here in Orange County that work at Auto Gravity. Um, we've actually built, we've, we've conducted all of our engineering here in California and Southern California. And we're really excited about just the community that we've joined. There's a lot of innovation coming from this part of the country, and we're, we're excited to see it really come to the marketplace. All right, so I'm going to have a link in the show notes to everything Auto Gravity so you can download it, get it on your phone if you're ready to go car shopping. They've also got a great loan calculator if you're still trying to figure out exactly how much car you can actually afford. As always, you can follow me on Twitter at Shauna Game and Instagram. I'm now at Shauna Game as well, so it just makes life a lot easier. And hey, if you enjoy this podcast, do me a favor, click the link in the show notes, head on over to iTunes, and leave us a five-star review. 